Hey guys, welcome to another episode of my Knot Tying series. But before we start today, I want to give a big thank you to all those that entered our recent giveaway competitions. Now, if you haven't checked it out before, I'll post a link in the description below. We have some great prizes up for grabs at the minute, so head over and check it out. In today's video, I'm going to be tying the Albright Knot. It's a brilliant knot for joining two lines together, extremely strong and ultra reliable. To begin tying the Albright knot, just take the stiffer of your two materials, fold it around your finger and just make a loop. Take the more supple of the two materials, in this case it's braid, just thread that through, clamp it in your fingers like so, pull yourself off enough tag end to work with and proceed to go round the two material, the two bits of mono there, eight times, and you want to go round clockwise. So that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Then just clamp that. Swap hands. Clamp that in your finger, and then you want to go back down. five times, so one, two, three, four, five, okay, and at this point you just want to make sure that the tag end goes back through that loop, Let's get my hand out of the way, tag end goes back through that loop exactly the same way as it entered, and then you just pull down the two tag ends that are left, like so. Don't pull it down all the way because at this point you just need to moisten that. Okay. And then just tug that down. You can use your fingernails just to push them coils down as tight as they go. Just pull it nice and tight. And that is pretty much done. You just need to take the scissors, trim off the unwanted tag ends. There's one. And here's the second one. And there, that's the Albright knot. That's all tied. It's very strong, ultra reliable, and that's ready to go out and catch you some fish. So there you go, guys. That's how you tie the Albright knot. If you found this video useful, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, or comment. And until next time, good luck in your fishing and tight lines.